Hey guys, Blake here with Feeling to Function, and I was going to give you my top three recommendations for while you're trying to lose weight. Um, aside from what I mentioned in my former video with the five most basic supplements, which I'll put a link to in the description, and those would be your top five supplements. But these would be additions if you had extra cash or you needed something psychologically that I've tried and I would highly recommend. Not because they're going to help your body burn more fat, build more muscle. That's all going to come through your diet. But I think these have given me more focus in the gym. Uh, they've helped me to recover faster. And they've just produced a uh, better mental me in the gym. So Super HD by Cellucor. It's a fat burner capsule. Um, I actually don't typically buy fat burners. This was like a promo with, I bought some whey protein and they sent me this. So I was like, oh cool, you know, I'll try it out. I'm trying to slim down a little bit right now. Um, and what I, this has quite a bit of caffeine in it. Um, and some, a pretty good blend of fat burning ingredients that have been fairly heavily studied. But I noticed when I'm in the gym, if I've taken this, I'm just in the zone. I think this just gives me stellar focus and I think it's been a pretty effective supplement. As far as additional thermic effects, I don't know about that. As far as additional fat burning, like I said, that's going to come from your caloric expenditure, calories in versus calories out. That's not going to come from the pill. But I do think mentally I was doing a lot better when I started taking this. Um, and when it's gone, you know, it's gone. I'm not going to probably buy any more. But a good fat burner will provide you with some caffeine um, and kind of put you in a different mental state. Because when you're trying to lose weight, you still need to be really crushing it in the gym in order to preserve all the muscle that you have. Because if you're a big problem with people a lot of the times, not to go off topic majorly here, but is when they want to lose weight, they just do so much cardio. And it's, I'm going to go in the gym, I'm going to do cardio, I'm going to do cardio. And they put weights on the back burner. But no one wants to lean down and not have any muscle and just be skin and bones or be fat still, just a skinny fat. People want to lean down to get cut and ripped and toned. In order to do that, you have to be busting your butt in the gym to have muscle to show off when you lean out. So prioritize the weights at all times, guys, and implement cardio as a tool. Your diet's going to be where your weight loss comes from, and then cardio is just a tool to make it so that you can eat more so you don't have to drastically cut your calories. Um, but back on subject, branch chain amino acids, uh, very highly controversial supplement as far as effectiveness. The branch chain amino acids um, are just free form amino acids which you do get through daily foods such as protein and such. I take them because I train fasted in the morning and so I haven't eaten anything so I take them just as a precautionary measure. As long as you're getting your daily protein at the end of the day they say they're pretty much irrelevant but there's other people that swear by them. There's not enough conclusive evidence either way but for me personally, I take them, I can afford it at this time. You know, maybe down the road somewhere, if I couldn't afford it, I would just start eating before I went to the gym and stop taking this supplement. But A, it tastes good, so it's a good sweet fix, as opposed to going and buying a soda or a Gatorade or something. I can take a scoop of this, and that's kind of how I, um, I don't know, how I justify buying it. It's because this is like 60 cents a scoop, or my friends go and buy a Gatorade for $2 a bottle. Well, I'm taking this once a day and they're buying a Gatorade once a day. I'm actually off better. And then I start to think about all the other supplements I've bought. I'm like, okay, well, maybe I'm wasting my money. But long story short, this is a good alternative for something that tastes great and can uh, help you achieve your goals as opposed to the typical soft drink. And it's fairly affordable if you think of it in that manner. You just don't want to go overboard with supplements. Finally, my third fat burning supplement. This is called Cardio Igniter by Top Secret Nutrition. Um, it's got beta alanine in it, like I referenced in my other video. Um, it's got the B vitamins. It's got a, it's called a lipobolic blend. Basically, it says it's going to enhance fat burning. I don't really buy into that, like I said, diet. But um, I felt so good when I took this supplement. This was a 35 serving container. And at first I was doing full scoops and I was I just felt like I was killing my cardio, whether it was first thing in the morning, in the afternoon, whatever. This thing gave me energy. I felt great. I was recovering great. And maybe it was mental. Maybe, I don't know, maybe when I was running stairs I was running harder because I felt like this supplement was doing it for me. 
but I don't know when I stopped taking it I did I didn't feel my recovery didn't really slow down necessarily and I'm pretty motivated so I still always did my cardio but I just didn't feel like I had that burst of energy and that power to push through and push for that extra lap or to run the stairs just a little bit faster whatever so I would definitely recommend you try this out if you're someone who you know you're doing your cardio but you just feel like you're dragging through it um, I felt like this gave me great energy and I even got to a point where I was doing half scoops because I noticed my tub was almost gone I still felt good so at that point it might have been mental placebo effect going on but nonetheless I think this was a great supplement and if I uh, was feeling really flush it would probably be one I'd go for again but so those would be my three recommended supplements that I've tried as far as fat burning uh, weight loss goals you're still gonna have to get your diet in check you're still gonna have to bust your butt in the gym but these are three things I think will help you mentally psychologically and just give you that extra push to make it to wherever your goals may be when it by whenever your goal may be so I hope this is helpful for you guys um, as far as the ingredients in these you can get on bodybuilding.com tigerfitness.com various other websites look at the ingredients study them make sure it's something that's going to be okay for your body um, and give them a try and tell me what you think if you have a favorite ingredient put it in the leave a comment and tell me what it is maybe I'll try it out um, I know a lot of people are also fans of L-carnitine and Yohimbine uh, this actually has Yohimbine in it and I've tried L-carnitine I don't know I didn't feel a great difference when I tried it um, and I don't really think anything necessarily is going to speed up your metabolism or target body fat specifically that much more than a proper diet so unless it's doing something for me mentally I usually just avoid it sorry to babble but thanks for watching guys click the like button if this helped you at all leave a comment if you have something you recommend I try or that you've tried and you really enjoy or that you're curious about and you want to know if I've tried and just didn't reference in this video um, but good luck I hope you achieve your goals Thanks for watching. Have a great night.